Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So finally I'm going to make this video something which is so close to my heart. So one of my favorite program which I ever used, it is like so sweet, so wholesome. Last year what I did is I created my own TV channel and most of you might say that you are just a stupid person who did something like this because this is so weird. Like why someone will do something like this? You can just go to Netflix and just watch whatever you want or you can just buy a subscription or you can just download, okay, and just play anytime. But the thing is that there was a motive behind it and it was pretty clear. One is people have this ideology that if technology change, you have to change with it. Well, the thing is sometimes what happens is our emotion get you know connected with technology and uh, even though new technology might uh, do things in a better way, but it it is not necessary that you have to move with it. So I was happy watching TV when I was a kid and I was you know really glad waiting for that you know the time when my favorite program will you know telecast but suddenly you know TV uh, culture declined and these days we can play anything anytime but still it's not fun you know you have to think what to play and you have to act, you know go and play it and it takes like you know it kind of kill the fun like the more fun thing is just you know play the TV and just watch whatever is on okay so i wanted that kind of feeling i wanted to feel my childhood again so i spent two days i downloaded like all the tv shows which i you know which disney channel used to telecast in those days when you know things were in four is to three and then after downloading after making a huge collection i even used like private records and after creating like a huge collection of all the seasons and everything what I did is I decided, um, you know, like schedule and it was so fun. Like I still remember like clock, let's just show. Okay. So what I did is like, I decided, okay, from 12 to six, I had one quarter from six to 12. I had like second quarter and then again, like third quarter, fourth, fourth quarter. So I just, you know, divided my day into four quarters. And then what I did is that I did, okay, I selected, uh, I guess five to six shows and in the first quarter i guess more than six shows i guess um yeah it was like 10 shows so okay i downloaded a bunch of shows so in the first quarter so you might be wondering okay but what if if you miss some episode okay so usually it was just sitcoms so it's not a big issue but uh, i i decided everything okay so in the first quarter i so for example if at 12 if i'm playing for example it's it's Charlie okay uh, I don't remember the name it's just Charlie okay so what I used to do is I, I used to repeat it uh, in the second quarter and uh, in the third quarter and the fourth quarter so every show you know have three repeats basically okay and it, it was so fun I watched the TV for one month and it actually made an impact okay i started to get used to that schedule and that i i forgot that this is not real this is like a fake tv and i was even able to play it on my uh you know 4k uh but you know in future i have some more plans like i want to create uh, uh, all the shows uh, which are old which is 4 is to 3 and i want to watch i'll create a tv channel and i will convert the digital to analog like signal conversion and then i'll use some vhs i'll buy some old school tv because why not okay i can do it and i want to do it and i just want to have that tv like a showpiece in my room and i i just want to keep it running uh this is just something i want for myself all right so yeah i am a weird guy all right you are so normal i'm weird okay so the thing is i'm going to show you like how i uh, did this i'm going to give you a gist because this is not like very easy you have to sit down and make a schedule and you know you have to uh, arrange it everything and i even had fillers okay so fillers in case if you don't know uh, i had like those disney uh, show ads basically you know the wand ids like wand ids nostalgia i guess so yeah these kind of wand ids you know i had all these all this okay and i i had like these ads like not commercial ads but you know like not the product set but the trailer of episodes or everything i had like fillers and i had all this i i even you know schedule those things not not like okay the program provides a lot of features let's just discuss this so irzz irzz tv now you might be wondering what i'm going to show you in this video so 
I I downloaded like bunch of Gilby movies. Uh, actually, I had a friend and she gave me a list of magnets, uh, RTXT file, and I just used Qubit Torrent to download all the Gilby movies. So she's a really big fan of Gil- Ghibli. Okay, and uh, now you might want to wait a second. A girl who is a fan of like Ghibli? What the fuck? Well, yeah, I'm not hallucinating. She's real. I'm. I hope like okay, she's online. But okay, it doesn't matter. Okay, it doesn't mean like I have seen her, but okay you know what i have this ghibli logo too so this is actual channel okay i'm not kidding like we have like logo we have like you can even have like commercial ads like but that would be okay too extreme i guess all right so i'm i'm not going to like show you like extreme version i'm just going to show you the basic in this video because um, it's really hard to you know teach everything in this one video so let's just download the program so you have to go to github and just click here to download the latest version i already have it i believe i'm not sure yeah i have this zz beta so let's just unzip it all right so after you unzip it let's just go to this directory this is it you don't really install it you just do this and you know suddenly your program start working so this is the local host and you have to open it now uh, there are a few things in which I might struggle so so my idea is like in this video I'm just going to give you a basic introduction you can do a lot of things like I also created one you know movies channel for myself so at the time like all the movies which I wanted to watch and what I did is like uh, I divided the day into I guess um, okay eight quarters all right so and then you know like I had two two hours movies uh, with the buffer of like so three hours slot and two two hours movies okay oh uh, if you you get it right okay so let's just create a channel you have to go to the first section channel and just create a channel for example ghibli movies okay and let's just upload a logo such a cool logo i got here and let's just add this channel okay so this is the first thing you have to do now you can do use jellyfin i was using jellyfin at the time but in this video i'm just going to do things simply so i'm going to just use local you can create your own local library like you know what i don't want to create i just want to edit the movies library and just add path okay so this is the path and uh, where is my movies wait okay this is the path guys of my movies collection so let's just add uh, save if we got it in movies okay we got it so once the path is added uh, we got the list of movies and uh, i what i can do is i can create a collection for myself so this is something you have to do you have to create a collection of uh, for example tv show or movies whatever you want to show so ghibli movies you have to figure out a lot by yourself i'm just going to you know just give you a basic introduction ex- and explain you some basic terms okay so collection is something you have to create um for any show or anything so let's just add these movies in collection so how we know we are truly living you know like if i close you in a room then your whole life can you say that you lived the life just because we are breathing we are living life okay so this is added let's just move ahead um and so all right so collection is created we got a gilby movie collection with uh, all the Gil- ghibli movies i have a hard time pro- pronouncing this now what we have to do is we have to create a schedule okay this is the next part now schedule i used to have like uh, if you want to have like a complete like really good tv channel you have to schedule things um, like timely you have to tell the time it takes time actually uh, i i spent like one i guess two to three four hours just creating a schedule once you do it then it's fine okay so ghibli okay let's just call it ghibli now i forgot a lot of things but uh, let's just have like shuffle schedule item and add schedule so wait wait a second okay let's add a schedule item now here what you have to do is you have to um i don't know what this dynamic is i i forgot so many things but usually uh, this is the part where you know you schedule everything uh, let's just give the collection uh, let me show you the channel all right you can skip some part so basically uh, here you you can have fillers and all but I, I didn't added any fillers so you have to go to 
this fillers preset section and then add fillers and then you will see some options of fillers so fillers are basically those you know ads or any stupidity to fill the blank space and in my case I, I'm going to make this video simple for you like I'm going to show the basics so uh, we are going to have like dynamic and we, I'm not going to enter timing or anything just save the changes and that's it that's the schedule it's going to randomly play I guess now let's create a playout so play in playout basically what we do is we give the channel we attach the channel with the schedule okay and schedule is attached to collection and uh, the <coughs> so collection is attached to media that's all it is okay so now if uh, if we double click on it this is our playout details this is the main thing okay so as you can see in my case like it's just random we are randomly just playing some movies and uh, the timing is quite fucked up like it's just randomly three like it's not like a it's not 3 a.m it's 3 24 okay and then there is no you know fillers you know we are randomly playing so when you create a proper channel it is supposed to be like uh, you know like you're playing some movie at three and then you're playing next movie at six okay uh, considering that movie is going to be less than three hours and after this i guess that's it no that's not it let's just go to settings no that is it okay so play out is the last thing i believe so now uh this is the link of the, so it 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 use ffmpeg to create a stream basically and i can use mpv to play the stream now when i'm i don't know why but when i play this it actually try to play the channel one which is a dead channel of rzztv which i don't want so what i did is i just changed it to two in the last okay and then play and now it's going to play our channel which i just created okay hopefully if everything is correct uh, so you can see in the logs of this program it is running ffmpeg command okay so there is one issue there is one issue there is no ghibli logo so it's because i am pretty sure like i messed up somewhere okay so let's just edit this uh, is the logo permanent watermark uh, let's just do one thing let's just go to watermark add a watermark so give Lee so watermark and I don't understand like what's the difference between watermark and logo uh, it's uh, I guess logo doesn't mean anything like logo do not uh, so what I'm going to do is so I uh, we created a watermark so now let's go to channel and uh, click on edit and here let's just add this watermark save changes and once we save changes if I play again let's see okay how to running rerunning a program will fix it more but who cares let's let's just see if it works now you know what we can still have the fun of channel without okay we got the watermark finally guys so this is the video this is like very basic okay so when this movie ends, the other movie will play and it, you can just have this stream running you, you just need this link and you instead of localhost you can run it on servers and you can just you know have a local tv and you can even do converters like buy digital to analog from amazon and it is like quite wholesome it is fun in case if you want to you know like have some old school TV channel. You, you can do anything. Okay, I'll recommend to create uh, four is two three channels because it will it will give you like retro vibe. Like have some old old media. All right, so that's it for this video. Thanks for watching this video. Uh, my purpose of this video is not just to teach you this program, but to introduce you so you can you know then figure out like read the docs. I and you can even join the group. So I remember asking people like how can I make a schedule because this is quite simple like having movie schedule uh, even though it was like quite messed up but if you are trying to create a schedule for tv shows with especially the epi episode wise like episode one two three you, you might have to struggle a little bit but if you dedicate yourself then you can have a cute little your own tv channel and it is quite fun to have even though it sounds stupid okay so thanks for watching this video see you in the next video